For over a year, Armenia has not implemented two important provisions of the tripartite agreement of November 10th, 2020, which ended the 44-day war between Armenia and Azerbaijan. First, Clause 4, that provided for withdrawal of Armenian armed units from the Karabakh region of Azerbaijan has not been complied with. And second, no practical steps were taken to unblock transport connections. Not only has Armenia not withdrawn its troops from Karabakh, but it has recently deployed additional forces there, and it started building new military fortifications at a strategically important height over the village of Farukh. Azerbaijan has repeatedly demanded via Russian peacekeepers to stop the construction of the fortifications and withdraw troops in accordance with the ceasefire agreement. In addition, Azerbaijan, using loudspeakers, demanded to stop illegal activities. However, these demands were not met, and as a result, the Azerbaijani armed forces entered the territory of the village of Farukh and took control of the Dashbashi height. Returning to paragraph 4 of the tripartite agreement of November 10th, 2020, it should be noted that it provides for the Russian peacekeepers to be deployed in parallel with the withdrawal of the Armenian armed forces. However, to this day, some units of Armenian armed forces remain on the territory that is under the temporary control of the Russian peacekeepers. Thus, the Russian peacekeeping contingent has not yet begun to fulfil its obligations. Not fulfilling, among other things, the obligation to disarm the illegal Armenian armed units. Moreover, Russian peacekeepers often pander to the Armenian armed units and sometimes even cover up their activities. All this obviously does not contribute to resolving the situation and ensuring sustainable peace in the region.